Okay, um, in this video we're going to make these two icons or two shortcuts for restarting, quickly restarting and shutting down your computer. As you know Windows 8.1 is a little bit of a pain in the neck to reboot. You have to right click on your start menu and then navigate over here to shut down then navigate over here to restart or shut down. It's so much better to just have a button you just click and go. So uh, a lot of people have requested these buttons so we're going to make them. So the first thing I'm going to do is delete these old ones. Okay. Now before we get started you need to download my icons. Um, I the all these icons you see here and the two that we just deleted um, are all icons that I I I think I created all of them. There might be one or two that I downloaded off the internet, but I they're they're created from pictures I downloaded from the internet. But the icon file itself I created. Um, let's see. All of my icons are, can, are viewed right here. Here's all of them. Now, what you need to do is you need to download those icons if you want to use them. You can use your own icons if you have something you'd rather use. But if you want to use my icons, you need to go to this address right here and download them. It's http colon forward slash forward slash goo dot g l forward slash m p now this is not two ones this is a small l and then the number one and then capital g and capital u so it's m p l one g capital g capital u and it'll download a little file called icon zip unzip those icons and place them anywhere you want on your computer, probably somewhere in your pictures, wherever you particularly want. I wouldn't put them on my desktop, but that's up to you. And unzip those and uh, so that they can be available for this uh, tutorial. Okay? Now, what we're going to do is, uh, first we'll make a restart uh, shortcut. So we're going to need this command right here. So it's shut down dot exe forward slash r space forward slash r space forward slash t space zero zero and I'm going to copy that and then I'm going to go on my sh desktop and I'm going to right click and go to new and shortcut and then I'm going to paste that command into that uh, dialog box and click next and I'm going to rename this Restart. And click Finish. Now for all intents and purposes it would work just like that, but we will have a few more tweaks. So we're going to right click on the icon, or on the shortcut I mean, and go to Properties. Now we want to change this window from Normal Window to Minimize Window. When you click on it you don't want that annoying black window to show up there for a second so just click it and make it minimized. Then we want to change the icon. Now you'll get this little warning. Click OK and you have to browse over to wherever it was you unzipped those icons at. So uh, I know I unzipped them. Unfortunately I'm going to have to navigate over there. I put mine in my pictures and then I have you know you know where you put yours so I uh, put mine in a folder called my speed dial icons is where I put mine and I want this green restart icon right there and then click OK and apply and OK and that one's done now we're going to do the shutdown. So we're going to, well, first we have to copy this shutdown command. It's the same as the restart, only it has an S. And copy. Right click on our desktop, new, shortcut. And then we're going to paste, next. And we're going to call this shutdown. And finished. 
then we're going to do the same thing we're going to right click on it go to properties change the window from normal to minimize change the icon you'll get that little warning click browse and this time it will open up to the last place we were just at which is the correct folder I'm going to use this red shutdown icon click OK click apply and click OK and we're done so uh, and I'm not going to save that <coughs> and now I could, I could click on them but uh, if I do that it will reboot my computer and end this video so we're all done take my word for it they work